WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi, everyone. Basil Chapman here, sitting in for Tom O'Brien. This is the 3 p.m. market update, TFNN market update. Dow is up 407. Loved what uh, the Fed was saying. 34,267. Uh, 30, 34,386 was the high just four sessions ago. It was looking a little poorly earlier on. But now look at this. The S&P has gone to a higher high. It's uh, above the 200-period moving average. This normally would be a very strong resistance area. I uh, see how many times we've hit it and failed to close uh, above it. Uh, maybe today we close above it. We'll be talking about that when we get back for the Tom O'Brien show, which I'll be sitting in for. We're looking at the QQQ, very nice uptrend after being very negative early on, uh, down to the 279s. Here we are at 289, up uh, uh, 891. And let's see. Yes, so this is uh, this is improving because for the first time, we're really starting to tackle determinately the uh, Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone in the weekly chart. We'll talk about that when we return. We're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000 small caps, struggling to get above the 200 period moving average, up three at 185.50. And this is going to be very important because we're looking at gold. Uh, gold was lagging earlier on. It wasn't fading, it was just kind of lagging. Started off nicely, then pulled back. And now, boom, it's up 17 to 1780. It's making a very determined effort with every single just about every single um, bar of the last couple of days making new recovery highs. Need to talk about that as well. We're talking about, um, let me go to the TLT. The TLT is trading up just four ticks at 102.03 as yields went a little bit higher. But most importantly, as I'm looking at this, look at the dollar. And the dollar has been a big influence. Dollar was running a little bit. Now it's down 61 ticks at 106.22, still above the 200 period exponential moving average in the daily. And we're looking at bonds. And we go to the bonds themselves. Bonds are now up 12 and 30 seconds. No, up, a, yes, 12, 30 seconds at 127. And I, this is going to be very interesting because it's it's had a big rally and it's kind of digesting gains here. Well, we'll talk about it when we return about all these different aspects. Uh, this is a very strong move, and I'll do the 10-minute uh, chart. It's made a leg C in the Chapman Wave methodology. It should still go to a D by the end of the day. We'll see what happens there. Uh, be back in a moment for the Tom O'Brien Show. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. Hope to see you in a few minutes. It's going to be a very interesting last hour. Tom O'Brien promised us very exciting last hour today. <laughs> 